Hi y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a makeover in our master bedroom bathroom toilet area. It's not our whole bathroom, it's just a little area where our toilet is. Yeah. It Since we moved here, it's just been blah, ugly. And we always knew we wanted to do something to it, so we so did it. We went ahead and did it. Um, you'd be surprised what a little bit of trim, a little bit of paint would do. Uh, relatively cheap. Um, we put project. we had fifty dollars in the uh, molding, and we already had the paint left over from another project. So around fifty dollars, and it made a really big impact. Yeah, you'll see in a minute. But um, it took us two days to do it. That's we got off work, and we did it for a little bit. But if you had one whole day, you can knock it right out. It's very easy. The main thing is painting and letting it dry, all that good stuff. But um, let's get started. All right, y'all, so we just took the trim off. Now we're adding this spackling. We're trying to fill this pretty big gap here. And this stuff is supposed to dry within five hours. So after that, we'll be ready to paint. Goes on pink, dries white. All right, so we put some tape up just to kind of see where we want to map it out. And so far, this is what we came up with. This is just the back wall right here behind the toilet. We're gonna be, we're gonna be doing these other walls as well. Show the walls. Yeah, we're gonna hit this wall and then we're gonna do the bottom next. Yeah. And we got that spackle starting to dry. It turns pink when it's wet and it dries white. But like she said, we're gonna go ahead and uh, just map this out just to see what we need to do. And if we like it, that way you don't have to take it off if you don't like it. Yeah, we're getting ready to measure. This is not how it's gonna look. <laughs> this or is this, just actually, a rough dry. this is it. So just make sure you hit the subscribe button. <laughs> we're done. And uh, here's the reveal. Thanks for watching. Here's the reveal. <laughs> Hit it at an angle, baby, when we do it. Do the other piece at the end. All right, y'all, we just got finished. <laughs> All right, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Start over. No, just go ahead. Just go ahead. All right, guys, we got one done, and we got the border. It's looking pretty good. Mm hmm We got two more to do tonight, and then we're calling it a night, and then we're gonna start back in the morning. So we got that picture frame effect right here. We'll hit some angles up here in the corner. And uh, yeah. this spackle just, it's almost dry, it's still a little pink, but it's getting there. And uh, that's how we do it today. What we did is we went ahead and measured side to side and then uh, divided it in half and found our center. All right, guys. Oh, <laughs> uh -huh. All right, we got this side going on. We got one more side to do. Just like that, it's put together. And we got some sanding to do, and we gotta sand this side right here. And we gotta put some trim right there. And then we're gonna do something on the bottom over here, and then right here on this side. And then we gotta paint and all that good stuff. But this is day one, and we'll, we'll see you tomorrow.
picked up these um, wicker shelves on Marketplace today. I got a really good deal on them. But I'm not loving the white, so I'm gonna paint them to make them look like wicker again. I'm using this Rust-Oleum in the color khaki. So we'll see how it turns out. 